crazy story today. A drone was discovered at the White House. The president and the first lady are in India. But the big question is, who put this drone, flew it over toward the White House and landed it on the lawn and why? Kevin Cork joins us now from the White House. So what do we know about all this uh, so far, Kevin? Well, so far, what we do know is it's a quadcopter now. As you know, that's commonly referred to as a drone. And given the size, reportedly, of the device that was found here at the White House overnight, it's likely the kind that you could buy at any hobby shop. Now, overnight, it was a very active scene here at the White House. In fact, that's continued. In fact, all morning long, we've seen Secret Service personnel combing the grounds, making sure there are no similar devices here in the area. Uh, while we have a moment, let me show you what Secret Service spokesman Brian Leary is saying about what was found here overnight at approximately 3.08 a.m. A Secret Service Uniform Division officer posted on the south grounds of the White House complex heard and observed a quadcopter device approximately two feet in diameter flying at a very low altitude and ultimately crashing on the southeast side of the complex. Now, we do have obviously very good news. It doesn't appear to have been a dangerous event. And obviously with the first daughters here and they are fine, that is of paramount concern for the Secret Service. But it's also interesting to point out that given the size of this one, this could be anything. And you probably know this, these drones can range in size from a tenth of a pound all the way up to hundreds. And they can range up to thousands of dollars if you buy one. But right now, so far, so good. We'll We'll keep an eye on what happens with the investigation. But I'll for now, back out to who you. That thing belongs to Kevin. Thank yeah. you very much.